On the Monday Countdown Podcast, it is now time to cancel all of Elon Musk's government contracts. Tesla, SpaceX, whatever other crap he's selling us. He is now actively engaged in a post-hurricane effort to spread potentially fatal disinformation and misinformation about FEMA's recovery efforts and the impact in the affected states. He is also now working in an in-kind donation turning Twitter X into a Trump advertising campaign. It's time to cancel all the contracts and reassess his immigration status and hopefully deport him the hell out of the country. And if we can't do that by conventional means, President Biden, you have presidential immunity. Get Elon Musk the F out of our country and do it now. Meanwhile, working the refs actually works. The New York Times has actually noticed that something is wrong with Donald Trump's brain, but they are attributing criticism of him to computers. And lastly, the continuing effort to tear down Vice President Harris and her choice of interviewees, complaining that a podcast, probably the second biggest podcast in the country, Call Her Daddy, was one of her choices of interviews this week, along with a town hall on Univision and 60 Minutes, Politico implies that she shouldn't have gone on there because there's too much sex. How much sex has there been at Politico recently? What with the editor of the Politico playbook being accused of leaking his fiance's sex life to other publications in an effort to blackmail her into sex. Is the problem with this podcast, Politico, that there's too much sex in it or too little, less than you have in Politico playbook? All that and more on the Monday Countdown podcast, now live wherever you podcast. Mm-hmm.